Hey guys and welcome to a new video. Here's a quick before and after of an eyeliner makeup transformation. It's something more Arabic this time and always I start with the instant light spray makeup base to make sure that I hydrate her skin and set it for my makeup application. Next is the foundation and I'm using Divine Matte Liquid Foundation in number 35 with my foundation brush in number 36 to spread all over her skin. It's a medium to full coverage foundation and I always build the intensity as I go. Concealer is a number one and I apply it on the areas that I want to highlight like under her eye, the forehead and her chin. And with my blending sponge, I tap to remove all excess or harsh lines from the concealer. After that, I contour with the Divine Matte Liquid Foundation in number 50 and I apply it on the roots of her hair, her cheekbones and her chin. And then with my puffing brush, I remove all excess from the edges of the product and I make sure to puff it out perfectly. I set everything with the Filter Effect Loose Powder in number 0.2 and remove excess powder with my powder brush in number 25. Going to add a little bit of bronzer with the face palette on her cheeks and roots of her hair. I'm going to start applying a very simple eyeshadow on her eyelids. Starting with a light golden color on her eyelids and I then puff it out towards the eyebrow and I make sure that I highlight the inner corner of her eye. And then I do the same thing on the lower lash line to keep it as much simple as possible in terms of eyeshadow. After that, I'm gonna mark a very sharp and defined eyeliner on the upper lid and the lower lid, as well as the waterline, and I puff it out from the lower part of her eye. After puffing out the corner of the eyeliner, I'm gonna draw a very sharp edge for the eyeliner from the inner corner, as you see. And then I'm going to elongate the eyeliner with a sharp winged edge starting from the lower lash line and then I connect the upper and the lower lid together and I fill the gap. I'm using the Inglot Gel Eyeliner in black. As for the eyebrows, I'm gonna keep the eyebrows extremely natural and I'm using the Eyebrow Gel Mascara from Anastasia in Caramel. Lashes are from Samir Khuzani in number 77. As for the lips, I'm gonna keep a very neutral color on the lips. After that, I'm going to add a little bit the Kiss and Blush from YSL to give it a more plumped color. I blend the lashes together with the mascara and always giving the extra glow with the face palette in medium in number 222 to make sure that I give her this extra glow for her skin. And basically the look is done. Here's another quick before and after. I really hope you enjoyed watching this Arabic style makeup transformation and I'll definitely see you in the next one. Thank you.